What's up ladies and gentlemen, it's the FIFA trainer here. I'm going to show you a little bit about all the bags I have and what's the right one for you in your own soccer career. First one we're going to talk about is this little drawstring bag. It's good for, you know, something informal like if you have a game with your friends and it's not serious, you can fit whatever you need in here. It's not waterproof and the drawstrings are very small. It's going to hurt you if you carry it too long. The next one I'm going to talk to you about is a little more sturdier drawstring bag. This one, it's like double, double lined. It's much thicker. It's not gonna hurt you. You can pack your water bottle, no problem. Shin guards. You have a pocket here in the front. You can put your keys in here. This whole bag is waterproof, by the way. And it has plenty of room inside, so you can fit a ball, a few pairs of uh, cleats in here. And let me show you inside. It's pretty cool, you also have a pocket. So you can put your valuables in here, you don't have to worry about any, anybody stealing it. Alright, so it's pretty cool, it's not going to hurt you, you have plenty of room. It's just like an upgraded version of this, five times the space and more comfortable. Next bag I'm going to show you, this is if you're going to go to like tournaments and you, you want to make sure when you go on a long trip for a soccer game you have everything. So you want to bring anything you can think of. I have here an ankle brace, knee brace. I have a little tripod if I want to film something. Tennis ball, I can juggle with it or can massage my muscles. Uh, bring extra pairs of socks for your games. Plastic bag is good if you're playing on grass and your, your cleats get uh, dirty or muddy. Anything you need, I bring always extra clothes. So after the games, you don't want to be staying in sweaty clothes. And I have in here like a medical thing, sunblock, whatever you need. So big long trips, this is good. This has a waterproof on, on the bottom. It's not waterproof everywhere else. So this bag is waterproof all around. This bag is good because it's just waterproof on the bottom. And the last bag you need in your life is the bag for your equipment. This is where I have my cones, my ladder. I have some goalie gloves, all the balls. The important thing when you're looking for a good soccer bag, it's all in the drawstring. If it's really thin, let me show you the difference. This one is super thin, this one is thicker. Always get drawstrings that are thick, otherwise this thing is going to break down on you after you uh, do repeated use of opening and closing. So basically, you have the lightweight pack, the medium, the heavy duty, and your soccer training uh, bag. That's the only four you need in your life. And uh, if you have any more questions, just write them in the comments below and I'll be happy to answer them. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week for another video. Peace.